What's up guys, it's John Reeves Live, and today we're going to be checking out something that I'm really freaking interested in, and also one of my homies suggested that I check this out, and I'm throwing your name out there dude, Legions Gaming, okay? Said dude, check this out please. I love the anime Chainsaw Man. I've watched the intro to it, and I think I've watched one outro to it, but I thought all of them were the same, and he told me that every single one of the episodes has a different ending to it. So... In saying that, we're going to be going through Chainsaw Man ending 1 through, I think, 12 or 13 here right freaking now. I'm really excited about this. I love the idea of changing every single one of the endings. I don't know why they would have done that, but I love that they did. Seems like a huge effort for, like, an Easter egg that I missed, and I don't know how many other people might have missed this. So, either way, if y'all are new to my channel, please smash that sub button. Let's freaking do this. 3, 2, 1, BOOM! Yes, so I've seen this one. And I thought this is so cool. This is so catchy. Okay, listen, like him adding those who's in there at the end of that last line made that so freaking original. It almost reminds me of this like a killers-esque type song maybe a little bit heavier obviously than the killers but i freaking love this style of music and this outro scene makes me want to go rewatch this show it's so freaking brutal the animation is ridiculous and i absolutely love the story of the show i might go back through this show I freaking love this. That was so clean, man. That was so freaking clean. Also, I just wanted to say, Pochita. I freaking love Pochito, okay? He's like the coolest little extra character freaking ever. Step aside any freaking anime animal of all time. Pochito with a little freaking dog with a chainsaw face. Demon dog chainsaw. That's all you had to say. You had me at demon dog chainsaw. Oh my god, this base run, dude. That is so clean. Uh -huh. Power! I freaking love her. This is so catchy. What genre would you call this? There's like freaking jazz fusion in here. There's rock. There's like, I don't even know what this would be considered. The course right here has like a classic anime intro feel to it. But like, what would you call everything else? This is a definite fusion genre, but I like it. <laughs> Oh, 
freaking power. <laughs> He's probably one of my favorite anime characters. They are going off on some freaking bass lines on this. Second song, amazing bass line started it off. This sounds like we're getting heavy, folks. <laughs> this is the greatest freaking idea ever this reminds me of like some heavier freaking i don't even know like 90s metal or something like that and then way over the top taking system of a down to like their furthest extremes that's what this reminds me of and i'm in love with this already i have to look up this song This is so Freaking ridiculous, man. The great <laughs> even Power's face right here. Even Power's freaking face right here. Thank you so much, Legions, for freaking suggesting this. Like, I would have never known that there were all these hidden gems amongst the sea of awesomeness that is Chainsaw Man. Thank you. Thank you very much for this. Ah, but either way, like, I love the fact that it's very chaotic, just like the show is. There's so much stuff going on with the show, and I love that. The storytelling in it is perfect. I've got ADHD, like, extremely bad, okay? Like, 100%, it is consuming. And stuff like this keeps my attention really well. I'm loving the chaoticness. I'm loving, there's beautiful moments in it. Just like the anime, there's a lot of really pretty moments in this stuff. Like, that last song... I have no idea what that was called, but that had so much in it. It literally went from like grindcore to freaking whatever system of a down that would have been considered to beautiful, beautiful, the female vocalist there. And then they ended it and they left me wanting one last screen there, like one last note. They left me wanting something and then it went straight into this and I'm like, ah, that's freaking nuts. And the picture of power right here is amazing. I'm going back. Little 
to learn these dance moves. <laughs> this is amazing. It's almost so cohesive in its chaoticness that I feel like the same person was in charge of like writing everything. I don't know that that's the case. It probably was not. They are all obviously different artists. It just feels like that. It's also cohesive. And also, can we just say that like Luke from GOT Games is right in the bottom corner? I freaking love that guy. What in the world? That is so wild, dude. <laughs> That is beautiful. What is that? They're doing so many cool things with their vocals here. A lot of the times whenever you're doing stuff in studio, you can do things that are going to like temporarily damage your throat. And there was a scream in there that I heard him do where he like kind of sang into a almost yawn sound into an aggressive like added some rasp to it. You can do those things in studio. You can do them live. But if you're doing them while you're touring and you're doing like consistent grinding it out metal tours where you're doing like 29 shows in 29 days or something like that, you're going to blow your throat out. That was a really, really cool screen though. I love hearing random stuff like that where I'm like, he just threw it at this. He threw it at the freaking wall in this and just went for it. I love whenever I hear stuff like that. That was very cool. Mojang the gun demon. Again with a bass line, man. This is so clean. So awesome. Oh my god. Pochita! That was beautifully written. Like everything in that song had such cool purpose to it. There was a super low bass vocal harmony that was going on in the beginning of that song it sounded really cool they did a lot of depth to that and also something i would love to go back through this show i would absolutely love to go back through this show there's a lot of stuff that i missed and there's a lot of questions that i have like for instance the freaking gun demon i don't there's so much lore to this show that i don't feel like was like fully explained in the first season i don't know if they'll do it in the second or not but i would love to go back through and rewatch this show. So if anybody would be down with me doing that, comment below. I'm definitely down with doing this. This reminds me of Robot Chicken or something. Aww. She was 
is awesome. Anyone that does not know, that is the most random and possibly disgusting thing I've ever seen in an anime in my whole life. And I'm not going to spoil it by saying what happened if you guys didn't watch this and you're planning on going back and watching the anime. But please, if you have watched this in the comments, tell me what would your reaction be? I think I'd just go take a cold shower and drink until I forgot about that day. I've never been blackout drunk and I forgot about everything, but I would do that that time. For that, most definitely. Cold shower, drink until I can't remember. <laughs> oh. oh, God. Okay. <laughs> that is one of my favorite random things. This is beautiful. They're going like chin on us right now? Is this TK? Is that him? It sounds like him. That is, it's too close to him not to be him. I don't think anybody else has a voice like that and that yell. Dude, that is TK. That has to be. I'm going back. Pretty positive this is TK singing this. Dude, yes. This is amazing. That was my favorite. That was my favorite one right there. Musically, that was beautiful. Everything about that was insanely awesome. I was like, yes, I love this style of music. First of all, it's very challenging for me. I love stuff like that. And then TK's vocals. I don't even have to look it up. That was him for sure. And if it wasn't him, that guy is like a mimic. Okay, because TK has an amazing voice. It's very unique to him. He did the Tokyo Ghoul song and oh god i want to hear him do that live please if y'all know the name of that song drop it in the comments and if he did that on first take i am watching it right now after this <laughs> This episode. Oh, 
It's wild how they can make something so gory, so graphic, and brutal, so beautiful as well. Like, they're doing a great job with that. And if you know the story of what's going on there, that is such a sad and beautiful scene that's happening there. I mean, like, God, she just pretty much gives her whole body to save somebody. That was awesome. That was a beautiful, beautiful song. That looks so cool, dude. <laughs> That song, like, listen, it is blowing my mind how many songs I feel like are masterpieces on here. Like, the endings of these episodes are even better, I think, than the intro. I mean, honestly, I love the intro to Chainsaw Man, but I feel like the endings are absolutely masterpieces. And they fit the show freaking perfectly. Why you live? Dude, Power's got the moves, man. Yes. He is awesome. I have so many questions about this show, man. Nothing but nuts. Aww. Ban 
上に立って立ちくり遂げを指すようなこの痛みなど焦燥の正体に夢と勘違いしたくなる心もよいつだってだってからもヘイデンいつだってなんてかさばめいで大人になったって今みたいなたまでらたたたたたき火のラセスカンソみたいな視界をバックとばなら復讐の正体が飲め込んだみたいなマリーさえも寄りかかりやって生きてる人生いつもしたいショートにめいて化けをまとったって役に立つ I'm just gonna say, like, I love seeing them just like being normal people in the show because they've got so much heavy shit to deal with in the show that they just seeing them normal and walking around going to the grocery store is a relief because they deal with so much heavy stuff. So I, I love seeing that in this, this really cool ending. <laughs> Yeah, yo. Yes. That is awesome. Okay, so honestly, best endings to an anime I've ever seen in my life. And if you guys have some suggestions for others for me to check out that you think are better, please drop them in the comments. But to be honest, it's going to be hard. I've never heard of a show doing a separate ending for each episode. And I feel like they all correlate really well to each episode. So it was really cool to see that. I wish I would have known this earlier and actually watched them whenever I was watching the anime. Because as soon as the next one's over, I'm like clicking next episode. So like I was trying to get through and watch the entire season because I love the story. So much, and I miss a huge thing to it. So, thank you very much again. Last time, I'm gonna drop your name in this, but Legions, dude, thank you very much for suggesting this. Love this. One of my top five animes of all time is Chainsaw Man. So, I love that now. I know even more about this show. Again, thank y'all so much for watching this video. If y'all are new to my channel, please smash that sub button, spread some positivity out there, be kind to one another, and if anybody needs anything at all, I'm talking to you. If you need anything, freaking message me. All of my socials are at John Reeves Live. Send me a message, and I'll catch y'all next time. Freaking toodles!